Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Mahesh Trunakaraso. I'm so happy to see you all back in this uh, new session. And this session is going to be very, very important, especially during this uh, COVID-19 pandemic. And it's, it's been going on for the last uh, six months now. And uh, every nation and, uh, you know, in, the, in the, every country in the world has been suffering and has lost lakhs and lakhs of lives to this uh, coronavirus. And everyone has been praying that you know some nation should come up with some kind of medications or vaccinations to to combat this uh, COVID-19 pandemic and fight against this coronavirus and uh, make everyone's uh, life better and a COVID-19 free universe. That's what everybody has been praying for. Finally, there is a, a Mumbai-based pharma company from India has come up with uh, some great answer. I hope uh, this goes very well and uh, we fight this coronavirus. That's what we, uh, we, uh, we all look for. Okay, what is that magic medicine that is called favipiravir? Favipiravir uh, is basically, you know, it's been uh, it's been uh, used used in Japan against this coronavirus. Uh, they have been uh, using that medication in Japan uh, country. Okay, it's been uh, effective over there. But in, in Mumbai based. Um, Glenmore company it has got an approval from uh, DCGI Drug Controller General of India and they have been manufacturing these medicines uh, and it will be out on the market in a few days so uh, okay before we get into this uh, topic uh, if you have not uh, subscribed to my channel please uh, feel free to subscribe my channel and uh, every single like comments and uh, every single subscription I get everything matters to me okay so please let's get into this topic then what is this favipiravir favipiravir is an oral medication one point and what does it do it actually acts against RNA polymerase it is a RNA polymerase that is it is RNA polymerase means it's an enzyme so it it is an in it inhibits RNA polymerase this enzyme is essential for viral multiplication so once this medication inhibits or stops this enzyme there won't be any viral multiplication when there is no viral multiplication the viral load will not go up when the viral load won't doesn't go up the patient will not get worse the patient will actually get better both clinically everything right so the patient will uh, you know will uh, will try to get better and then they go home as soon as possible that's the ma magic of this medication and there are one more medication that is uh, that's called umifenovir and uh, you know the trials uh, claim that um, uh, favipiravir uh, acts better than the umifenovir so this uh, favipiravir is a RNA polymerase enzyme inhibitor and it decreases the viral load, right? So based on this medication, some uh, clinical trials have been going on in uh, different countries, uh, India, Japan, China and uh, Russia. Okay, in India what happened, uh, some in, in March or April, um, they conducted um, uh, this study like efficacy and the safety of this medication on 150 patients of COVID-19 patients. They conducted this trial. They started giving these medications to those patients and, um, uh, and assessed the efficacy uh, of these medications on those patients. So the, the good thing is, uh, once a patient uh, were put on these medications, uh, by four days, this medication started showing a great improvement in both clinically uh, patients uh, who had a headache or a cough or a poor oxygenation uh, or a difficulty breathing they really started getting better by four days that's what these are uh, clinical trials uh, claims the de complete details and uh, every uh, explanation will be uh, produced in, uh, in coming up days that's what they say and uh, if you look at China, uh, China they have uh, conducted this study b uh, with this medication in two different trials. Okay, and in one trial they included uh, 80 patients, and in the other trial they included uh, 2,146 patients. And the uh, first study on 80 patients uh, they also showed a similar uh, uh, outcome. Uh, they all the 80 patients uh, showed a similar outcome with a marked reduction in. Uh, in a cough and uh, the, their uh, difficulty breathing got better and uh, because of this medication and in japan uh, they already they've been uh, they have been using this medication it's currently under use for now and um, in, in russia also they have been uh, i mean the clinical trials have been going on and they have been also using this medication so five private and uh, how safety uh, this medication comes in the form of 200 milligram Mm, and this uh, pharma company uh, claims that uh, this medication should be given uh, 1,800 milligram twice a day for only one day and the next 14 days this has to be taken 800 milligram twice daily 
before uh, we put the, um, before we put this medications uh, or before we give this medication to patients mild to moderate covid-19 patients uh, the patient should be given uh, you know they have to give consents uh, to the doctors that uh, they are going to be on this medications for covid-19 so you know uh, so this study has been going on uh, and this medication uh, Uh, is is really really uh, working very well on this covid-19 mild to moderate covid-19 patients and, and is, this is just early stage and um, you know in many countries and uh, many clinical trials have been going on and uh, to just uh, check the efficacy and safety of these medications and uh, hopefully um, you know based on the clinical studies what i have found what i have read uh, i'm just sharing this video with you guys and um, oh, this is rna polymerase enzyme inhibitor and it decreases the viral load and thereby it improves the patient's outcome without uh, uh, sending the patient into poor oxygenation or uh, worsening of the symptoms and that's how this medication acts i hope uh, I, i wish you know i want um, many more tri- clinical trials uh, to come up and uh, using this medications and many more medications um, you know not only that just this medications we want, want we want some more clinical trials to eradicate this virus from this universe I hope I have given you enough information. Uh, I'm just giving you this information. I just wanted to share this information to you all guys. Uh, and um, I hope I will be seeing you in next video with another uh, hot topic. All right, until then, it's bye-bye. And um, take care, guys. I'm Dr. Mahesh Tanagarasu. See you soon. Bye-bye.